welcome to HodgePodge Australia. Today we're making this really gorgeous rosette sheet cake. This can be adapted to any color scheme and it is so simple to put together and yet it is so effective and gets lots of oohs and ahs. I've made one simple batch of buttercream and colored it five different ways. You can see there I have a lovely pink, I have a purple, I have a very vibrant blue, I have a more of a sky blue and some gray. I'm using a 1M tip for my lovely rose swirls with my pink. I have a 4B tip for my purple, which gives us those lovely Mr. Whippy swirls. Then I have a 2D, which is more of a closed in petal for my vibrant blue, which was so pretty. I then have a smaller 99 tip for my dots, and then I have the 14 petal tip. Now I've just made a simple Texas sheet cake here. This was a new recipe that I just tried and it's like a really dense mud cake. It is so delicious, but you really only need a little <laughs> slice at a time. So if you are gonna make this, let me know down below and I can put the recipe in the comments to let you know how to make it because this is great for parties as you only need to slice up a small piece for everybody. You can then just start with any color that you want. I like to do some larger swirls first, and this really is just a paint your own creation. You can just put whatever you want anywhere. Start with your bigger roses and swirls and then fill in some of the smaller areas. You can see I'm gonna use my open petal tip to just do some little ribbon effects in some of the creases. I found that it broke it up and just added a little bit of extra interest if there wasn't enough already to this already beautiful, colorful, vibrant cake. As I mentioned, this can be customized to anything. You can do any colors you want. You can do any swirls you want. You can use any tips that you want because all you're doing is filling in all the spaces just so that the whole thing is covered. And yet it doesn't seem to matter what you do and where you put it, it all comes together and it all just looks so beautiful. And as you start to get through some of these buttercreams, you can see some of mine are running out. All you have to do is pick up one of the other colors and fill in that spot there. And I'm gonna be very pedantic and put in just a couple of little jewels here with tweezers because um, I didn't want too many on there and if I just sprinkled them on I was sure to make a mistake and that is how simple it is to make a rosette sheet cake it is so gorgeous so awe inspiring and gets so many comments and yet is so easy thank you so much for watching another hodgepodge Australia video make sure you like and subscribe we'd love to see you again real soon